Dear students, today I am going to teach you one question related to trigonometry of class 9. Here the question is like this. Find the value of cos 600 times sin 510 minus cos minus 690 times sin minus 660 degree. Okay, and its value answer is given here minus 1 whether it will cover or not we will do and see. Okay, now here let us write down this one cos here our question is cos 600 degree let us put like this only sine 510 degree minus this cos minus theta is just cos theta cos 690 degree we can write why you know it is like this see if there is like this cos minus theta then this is equal to just cos theta instead of cos if there is sine sine minus theta then this will be equal to minus sine theta okay so these are the two formula so we can do according to this okay so these are the formula so what we can do here this is cost 690 and sine minus theta minus sine so, so minus uh, sine 660 degree we can write like this okay now this is equals to now let us break the angle okay so while breaking this angle if it is up to 360 we can just do 360 plus theta, 360 minus theta, 180 plus theta, 180 minus theta, or you can use 270, 90, we can use. But the 600 degree, we cannot do from 360. So, what we can do this one, see, cos will write as it is. 600 degree can be written as 90 times 6. Look at it, 90 times 6 is 9, 6 are 63. So, the 6, uh, 9, 6 are 54, 540. And 540 plus 60 will be equal to 600. We can break like this. See, you can take the help of a calculator also, or like this we can break. Okay, times sine 510 now. So 2 to 510. Now 90 will multiply. 95s are now. 95 is 95 is 45. 450. Now 450. So like this 90 times 5 we can do. 95 is 450. 450 plus 60 will be equals to 510 so similarly this, this minus and this minus will be multiply see this minus times this minus will be plus here now break this also cos now 690 will break okay 690 means 90 times 7 because 9 7 is 63 that is 630 630 plus 60 will be equals to 690 degree and again dot this one sine c sine as it is now 660 can be break as 90 times 7 this also 97 the 97 the 63 so 630 630 plus 30 degree will be equal to 660 degree okay we can break like this now this can be written as so now 90 times 6 plus 16 now how to do look at here is i will show you see in this uh, in this way we can find out see look at here look at here, here like this see properly we look at here properly so this is after is school to college okay now here this is 90 times 1 will be here so here 180 that means 90 times 2 will be here so similar this 270 this is 90 times 3 and this is 90 times 4 will be here similarly 90 times 5 here 90 times 6 here 90 times 7 here, 90 times 8 here, 90 times 9 here, like that, and go on. Like this, we will keep on rotating in anti clockwise direction, okay? So now look at here 90 times 6 plus 60. So 90 times 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 90 times 6 is here. Now plus 60 means it is in third quadrant. In third quadrant, tan and cot positive. So cos will be negative. So we will put minus. Look at it. Eh? Look at it eh? properly. See. See, cos 90 times 60. 90 times 60 means 90 times 1, 2, 90 times 3, 90 times 4, 90 times 5, 90 times 6 here. And then again plus 60 is there. So 90 times 6 plus 60 will be here in the third quadrant. In third quadrant, tan is positive but our is cos so cos will be negative here minus understood now since it is six even number even number see always odd number one three five seven nine eleven it lies in y-axis and ratio will change in that 
but if it is 2 90 times 2 4 6 8 10 like that it lies in the x-axis and in the x-axis ratio do not change so cos here 6 lies in the x-axis so cos will remain cos as it is and then 60 degree we can write as it is like this see times now this one see now again see sine 90 times 5 so 90 times 5 1 2 3 4 5 here and then plus 60 means plus here in second quadrant in second quadrant sign is positive so this value will come plus no need to write minus here plus and look at here 5 90 times 5 5 lies here in the y axis so in y axis ratio will change so sign will change into cos here cos and this 60 degree as it is we can write now plus again see now this one turn okay now cos 90 times 7 plus 67 now where will, where will the 7 will I see 90 times 1 here 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 here 9 times 7 here plus 60 means this side plus 60 means this side fourth quadrant in fourth quadrant cos is positive so minus no need to put cos only now 90 times 7 7 means here in y axis in y axis ratio will change so this cos will change into sine cos will change into sine and then the 60 degree as it is 60 degree okay now times multiply okay this is multiply now here you can see sine 90 times 7 plus 30 okay 90 times 7 means 90 times 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 here 90 times 7 here plus 30 lies in fourth quadrant plus 30 here fourth quadrant so in fourth quadrant sign is negative minus so bracket see minus now 7 means it lies in y axis see 9 times 7 it lies in y axis in y axis ratio will change sign will change into cos and then this one 30 degree 30 as it is we'll put like this okay so this is main part of this uh, chapter okay so you need to learn in this way now now look at here how to simplify this minus times plus will remain minus as it is cos 60 value of cos 60 is 1 by 2 times this cos 60 also 1 by 2 now minus times plus is minus again sin 60 is root 3 by 2 and again cos 30 also root 3 by 2 we can put like this so this is equals to minus 1 times 1 1 by 4 and again minus root 3 root 3 is 3 by 4 we can write this is equals to LCM 4 if you take 4 LCM then it will minus 1 minus 3 so this is equal to minus 4 by 4 which is equals to minus 1 okay this is the value of this one so in this way we can find its value now I will give you some more question for your benefit okay you can learn we can you can do these questions and then get more benefit okay the questions are like this okay I will write the sign okay find the value of first of all let us write down find the val value of okay find the value of what to find look at a eh? sign 600 degree sign 600 degree times tan minus 690 degree plus sec 840 degree and then times cot minus 945 degree okay this one value you need to find out and its answer will come 3 by 2 okay you can do this one and more questions you can practice from your book also these both of these two questions are out of your book okay and then now you can get more benefit okay thank you for watching this video